An old bird can learn new tricks. All it requires is patience and mostly love. Animal Allies Guide to Bird Obedience. Bird lover Sue Patrill shows how simple it is to train and tame birds, even wild birds like the Australian magpie. Magpies are usually not known for being this friendly. They're usually, a lot of people think that all they do is swoop and make a lot of noise, but they're really very intelligent. Out of all the wild birds, magpies would be the most intelligent. To get up close and personal, you must first win the bird's trust. I've just started by very gradually offering them little bits of food and then bringing it closer. That's how I've sort of trained them to get up onto my lap. The most important thing is that you don't overfeed them because then they will stop looking for their own food, which could end up being a catastrophe if you moved home and you weren't available to feed them. Outside, Sue has another bird friend, a sulphur crest cockatoo, who, like the magpies, loves a little sweet talk. It's very important when you're approaching birds that you're um, confident and calm, you don't show any um, nerves or, or tension around them because they'll pick up on that vibration. They like to hear a soft, comforting voice. He keeps very receptive to that. They love a lot of toys in their cage, um, gives them an activity. Their food's an activity as well, but um, toys are very important. Good nutrition is a must. Rocky is fed a full range of fruit and vegetables every morning, ensuring he has plenty of energy to perform at his best. If they've got good nutrition and they've good housing and adequate toys, they'll perform a lot better for you. So, to keep your feathered friend well behaved, check out this week's Animal Allies How To. Approach birds calmly and confidently. Speak in a soft, comforting voice with lots of praise. Give them toys to prevent boredom and provide a healthy, balanced diet.